When it comes to snow in Colorado, timing is everything. 6 p.m. The sun is setting and the snowfall has begun. But how much is enough to cancel or delay the next day's school? The answer will take some time. Weather alerts and stuff. This is James Korth, a DCSD groundskeeper lead. On nights like this, he is a spotter. Out spotting for the current storm happening in the district. He's monitoring temperature, location, accumulation, and of course, the time. It's 11:21. This night starts at Thunder Ridge High School. Douglas County covers a wide terrain, so weather conditions will vary from school to school. Just because of the elevation, we could have rain down at Thunder Ridge and two inches of snow up at Mountain Vista. So far, the accumulation isn't much. He's looking for how much snow is sticking to the roads. So once we get the one inch trigger debt, we activate the plow trucks. Even with a small accumulation, the temperature is a concern. 32 degrees right at that freezing point. We're going to head out to Roxboro. Roxboro looks much the same, except for the deer enjoying the weather. The roads are starting to get covered. The snow is getting worse toward Larkspur. There's even enough for James to break out the plow. Snow is just starting to stick a little bit up here. After a quick check-in with a contracted snow plow, it's time to prepare the sanding crew. Plowing will be minimal. The sand will help keep slick spots under control. No, I think we're good right now. Sounds James good. reports his findings to district leadership. Okay. Sounds good. And the call is made. Well, thanks, James. On this night, there will be no closure or delay. Next time, Colorado may have other plans.